Jim, you are unmuted. You're good to go. Thank you, Amanda. Thank How you. are you? Good. Good, good. Hey, have you watched any of the recent UFC shows when it returned? And if so, were you able to get a feel of what's going on with no crowds and even the smaller cage by watching it on TV? Yeah, I, I think it's like pretty cool, you know? It's a different experience. We'll be able to listen the corners. That is gonna be very, very good. But uh, of course we miss all the, the, the fans, you know? But as soon everything is gonna pass and everything is gonna come back normal. What has American Top Team meant to you, Amanda? My, my gym? Yes, American, American Top, Top Team? Team yeah. meant to you? You know, it's the best gym on the planet, you know? Since I step in that, in that gym, everything changed in my life. That gym means a lot to me. How are you looking at this fight? As far as past fights you've had, not looking ahead to the future, just what are you looking for out of yourself for this fight? You know, what I look for is like, I feel like everything, what I'm gonna do, I have to step first in the cage, you know, to see what is my game plan I'm gonna put in there. So I, I feel like five rounds I expect for this fight, it's gonna be a better. Felisa is a is a tough opponent, and yeah, I expect being very sharp, you know, very smart, and then wait to the best moment to finish this fight. Was there any difference in training because of the pandemic, because of COVID nineteen? Did you have to do anything differently? You know, we just talk about the gym now. Like uh, the gym, make everything easy for us. They leave the, the, the door is open for me, you know, we make a very good schedule. Uh, we train separate from everybody, everybody train separate for everybody, you know, everybody have your time to go to the gym and they sanitize everything. We clean ourselves very well too and stay home, home, gym, gym, home. And we, I'll be able to do my whole camp and I'm ready to go. And what do you think of your opponent? And did you watch the battle she had with Cyborg? And did that, uh, does that even, do you even do things like that? Watch their prior battles, watch their other fights to start, try to pick things up? Yeah, for sure. I have a breakdown on her, especially with that fight against Chris. That was a good, a good view, you know, from, from her game. And I, I know she's gonna try to, to clinch. I know she's gonna try to put me against the cage, but you know, I'm ready. I have like a very good strategy for her and um, I'm going to be ready for everything she's going to bring Saturday. And lastly, Amanda, you are the best fighter in the world. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you have two championship belts. Any chance of going for three, four, five championship belts? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I wish, but like this weight, uh, losing weight sucks, you know? I feel like um, go down to 125, like for me, I don't think that is gonna happen. You know, I'm like, I have so much to, to lose if I go down and I, I prefer to stay here, you know, 135, 145 for me work pretty well. I thank you, Amanda. Thank you.